bar. Oh. It's, it's unjustifiable how terrible you are. Those whack punchlines are going to be carrying you far. You look like a fucking bobblehead with a busted grill. A packy version of Mr. Mackey and Dr. Phil. I have to criticize his massive fitted ties and hideous noggin. You're not a goon because you got the grill of a goblin. The Rochester has got nothing on the sides of his dome. Put you on Godzilla. That's yeah. a punchline in its own. Yeah. And overall, you look like groundskeeper Willie. <laughs> so struggle is patient. It's the only time this clown keeps you filthy. You're so pathetic, it's almost depressing. In your future battles, I got a suggestion. Never bring your girl. I guess that nobody taught him the lesson. I mean, that spells out a disaster for me. That bitch is kind of like the letter E. Always coming after the D. In whole economics, in whole economics she's got a master's degree. For next to nothing, she'll get the sucking head is practically free. That infected snatch smells like a McDonald's breakfast wrap if it was left inside of the sun for a month and collected back. Woo! Yeah, this midget hater's an arsenal wannabe. But you're the biggest joke in beast mode, so this is bars versus comedy. So someone please explain how Jared's better with rhymes when he can't rap for 60 seconds without forgetting his lines. Hey yo, I got a short fuse. And I'm expecting short jokes because I'm a short dude. But your career is going to be short too. <laughs> I traveled a short distance to beat this no name with no money. I guess you could say that I'm feeling short change. Oh. Oh. So fuck your short jokes because I'm much more focused on how you ducked your battle with Smitty on such short notice. Oh. And you used to take the short bus to school. Now you're just always hammered. I guess that's the reason why you're such a tool. Yo. You need to get off the oxys, moron. If you're a battle axe warrior, then I got my sword drawn. You brought this moron. Lock his forearm and smash him over the head with the mirror that he uses to chop and snort on. <laughs> Yo, fuck. Yo, fuck Doobie and whatever town he's supposed to be from. I don't give a fuck. I'll shit on any angle he tries exposing me from. <laughs> Yeah. His last battle, he's gassed up because he choked and he won. But I already showed you how choking and winning is supposed to be done. <laughs> yeah. I'm about to put this freak in his place. You look like someone stepped on your face, and your head is so big that you could see it from space. I mean, you could use that shit as a projection screen. You gotta be the ugliest motherfucker I've ever seen. <laughs> got jerked, you lipped off, so now you're just gonna get ripped on worse. The day this motherfucker learns to write a hip-hop verse, Stephen Hawking will get up and do the crit walk first. <laughs>